I'm old school when it comes to the FA Cup and I believe it is still an important competition and that is why uh, I'm very excited to be welcoming Stoke City to Carrow Road for our third round cup tie with them. You can't beat the magic of the cup. The magic, the romance. Uh, when I was a boy growing up, cup final day was a, a massive day in the footballing calendar. Uh, it was the only game that was televised uh, live. Uh, the build up in the morning, all through the day, to the game itself in the afternoon. Uh, fantastic stuff. Uh, really enjoyed it as a, as a boy. It was what I was brought up on. So, uh, Stoke City, third round, FA Cup. Let's do this. Right, as I said, uh, FA Cup, still important, uh, but I don't want it to become uh, too much of a, a distraction, although it's always nice to do well in the FA Cup. Our, our bread and butter this, this season is the league, and... Our main aim is, is promotion, but uh, a cheeky little cut run wouldn't go amiss. So, uh, today we welcome Stoke City to Carrow Road. Uh, we're all looking forward to it. So, let's see the team that we're going to go with. Uh, Tim Krull, back in goal, not through choice, not through my choice. Uh, our standing keeper has been injured, so... Tim Krull comes back in. Uh, I hope he can mend his ways from the last time he played. Uh, he was absolutely awful. And I, I would have kept him out a little bit longer. But we've got uh, a slightly rotated squad for this one. Um, we really are up against it with uh, our energy levels. Everyone's being asked to, to play every game. I'm, I'm trying to put out the, our best 11 all the time. And, and the injury risk is increased so a few people have been stood down today not completely out of the picture they're, they're on the bench and, and will be able to come in if needs be so um, this is what I'm going with and as you can see uh, a few players are lacking in match sharpness and may struggle to see out of the match uh, Stoke well we've played them in the league and we, we, we've beaten them, beat them uh, away from home. So I'm quietly confident of getting a result today. Uh, as long as we can do it without picking up too many injuries, or any injuries, that would be nice. And it would be nice to, I, I don't want uh, extra time or, or penalties. So this is a great opportunity to show all the experts they've been right to back you up. That's what they're being told, and they responded well. Lucas Rupp, I have faith in you. So, opposition instructions given by my assistant. And we're all set to go. Didn't think he was going to keep that in, but he did. Uh, and, and a decent cross, but nothing comes of it. Stoke, I believe, are without a manager at the moment, or a, a permanent full-time manager. They've got a stand-in. Um, sometimes that's a little bit unsettling at the club. Oh, that's a great ball over the top. Well, he, he was on his way, and he hesitated. He held back, and the... The chance was lost. We've got good possession stats. I'm going to keep our mentality on positive. 
That's a great nod. Oh, a pile driver over the top. But it's all us at the moment. And here we come again. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. What a cracking goal from the young lad. Excellent. That's a, that's a great start. 12 minutes on the clock. And a cracking goal to put us into the lead. Thought Crawl was going to make a mess of that one. Side to Broby. That would have been nice, but not to be. Midway through the first half, we're very much in control. Rupp needs to calm down as he's already been booked. Here we come again. Throw to us on the far side. McLean can hit him. Yep, we've certainly got him rattled. Oh, that's a great save. That's a great save. Let's work the ball in, I think. Half time. Well pleased with that. Could have done with uh, a second goal, but hopefully we can get that in the second half. So I'm well pleased. made the tackle but decided he didn't want the ball I hope this doesn't prove costly it's out for a corner away away well done. is there a break on no there's not Cleans off with it. 
plays Broby in. Not a great shot, but he's still with us. That was poor. That was very poor. I hope we don't pay for that. Mumba with plenty of space to run into. Oh, James just couldn't wrap his foot around it. I think he was offside anyway. Yeah. Don't really want this to be a, a nervy 1-0. Certainly don't want them equalising. Extra time is, is the last thing we need. Gathers, excellent. Let's bring Oliver Skip on. Maybe he can steady things in midfield for us. That's a good ball. Young Ida's onto it. Boom! Call the ball. Unlucky. Space. Oh, 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 I say, young Ida, he's onto that, and he's he smashed it in. They they didn't see that coming. I didn't see it coming, but another excellent strike from the young lad. Well done. Let's just dumb things down a little bit. Let's be a bit more disciplined. And, and see this one off. We never make it easy for ourselves, do we? So we're in the time added on. Game's all, almost over, but let's throw in a bit of time wasting. Time's up, Fat Lady sings, and we've cracked it. We're, we're in the hat for the fourth round. Excellent stuff. A good win, boys. Well done. Okay, um, what I'm going to do is... Uh, I'll probably finish it, finish it here, and and I'll let you know who we've drawn in the next round uh, when we come back next time. But thanks for joining me. Uh, a win in the FA Cup is always special. So once again, thanks for watching.